This week's Songs of Praise has an international theme because we're visiting this church in Peterborough with a congregation that includes no less than 50 nationalities. Every Sunday you can meet people from all around the world. I'm looking forward to meeting some of the people who worship here, who were born thousands of miles from Britain, but who now count it as home. From Africa, from Egypt, from India. But what's brought them here? Also, there's a great song from Southfield's Junior School Choir here in Peterborough, finalists in our school choirs competition. Kingsgate Community Church is just 21 years old. It's based in a modern building on the outskirts of the city and attracts a diverse congregation. You'll find more than a thousand people here every Sunday enjoying a contemporary style of worship. Here at Kingsgate Community Church they like to celebrate their differences. One way they're doing that is by holding an international evening. I think there's a dragon missing. And of course, food always goes down well. Just look at this spread. I just think it's fantastic. Look at the rainbow that we have represented here today with, with the nations represented. Look at the flags, the different foods. I feel no matter which country you come from, you belong. And that's what I feel is really good in this church. Arriba Mexico! As many people know, Italians are very loud and we like to be a centre of attention and it's nice, yeah. I think the diversity of a nations coming together as one. I think everybody is, is actually able to give something of their own culture to us and we can give to them as well. Coming from different tribes, Hutu and Tutsi, and being able to eat together and cook a meal together and share it together, it's definitely the power of God, the power of His Spirit that has been able to unite us as a brother and sister or sister and sister. For our songs of praise, we're all joined under one roof. So what's on the menu? Well, great hymns and songs, old and new, something for everyone to enjoy. And leading the singing, well, it's my pleasure to welcome a very special person, songwriter, worship leader, Noel Richards.
One couple who are now part of the congregation here at Kingsgate are Folu and Adi Kahide. They began their married life in the capital of Nigeria, Lagos. Fresh from university, Adi was looking for work as a physiotherapist, and Folu had a lucrative career as an accountant. They were well off, but they could have been a lot richer if Folu had not resisted the culture of corruption. There were people who worked for me and who worked around where I worked who were not particularly happy that I wasn't involved in what was going on. As Christians, we live by the values of the Bible. It was very stressful to the point where I, I got threat, threat letters um, wanting to kill me and my family. And um, we made a decision that we, we had to leave. Folu and Adi didn't tell anyone that they were leaving Nigeria because they didn't want to be stopped. They felt they had to get away. It was hard. Life was very hard. I came first because I was born here, so I did have a right of a boat to live here. But I couldn't work as a physiotherapist, but I still had to make ends meet. So in the end, all I did was cleaning. When I came out, I was holding down three jobs. And I had to say to her, you know, you give up one of those cleaning jobs, I would do one of them. We lived on cereal, mm -hmm. milk, eggs and bread. That was all we ate you know, because we couldn't afford anything else. But one thing was, we never doubted that God had a plan in the future for us. Well, why give you the hardship, though? Was it a test, do you think? You know, the Bible says that in, in life you will have trials and tribulation, and I think that sometimes our life experiences actually shape on our faith, you know, yeah. increases, you know, the, the, the depth of your faith in God. Do you miss your old life? Do you miss Nigeria? In, in some sense, yes, some, in, you know, maybe from a family, friends and culture, atmosphere, then yes, you know, you know, there's nothing like back home. But I feel I'm where God wants me to be, even though I am not at home, but I do feel at home here, especially because of the family of God that we've been blessed to be with. Did you feel that you're enhancing people's lives by being here then? Oh, yes. We believe God has given us the the gift to be able to counsel people. And what Kingsgate has done for us is actually trained us and has equipped us to be able to stand alongside people. People from different backgrounds with different issues. What's your name? We're here, you know, to help people know Christ and to help people in different circumstances to, you know, know the purpose of living and just to, you know, just to have a fellowship or a relationship with a God who loves them.